so hello to all my viewers with me i've got uh, dr ashwin who has secured all india rank 308 in the neat pg 2025 exam and uh, his journey is very much inspiring because from a rank of 84000 in his first attempt he has shown tremendous improvement to reach an all india rank of 308 so welcome and a hearty congratulations dr ashwin thank you sir okay so ashwin are you feeling so happy right now after the uh, months of effort uh, yes sir yeah uh, yesterday even i could i couldn't sleep because of the excitement after uh, okay. seeing those such okay, a right. good rank right right so i couldn't sleep because of the excitement i think that is one good reason that uh, you know you're not sleeping that is one good reason right yeah right. so uh, Ashwin, uh, can you just tell the viewers a bit about yourself? You're from which place? You did your MBBS from which college? Uh, mm, sir, uh, my home is in uh, Kolkot. Uh, okay. I did my uh, MBBS from uh, Government Medical College, Trishur, uh, the 2018 batch. Um, at, uh, after uh, I gave my uh, first attempt uh, after our internship, and it didn't come up well. It was, uh, I got a rank of 84,000. Right. This is right. my first dedicated attempt after right. one year of preparation. Right. And Ashwin, uh, so happy to see your achievement. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure the viewers also want to know on how you prepared. So first of all, coming to your journey with Doc Tutorials, can you just, uh, uh, you know, uh, tell us uh, what were the subjects that you liked most in Doc Tutorials? Any particular mentions, any particular subject mentions? Uh, sure, sir. Uh, I, my favorite uh, faculties in doctorials were yourself. I watched most of uh, your videos, mainly uh, neurology videos and cardiology videos. Uh, also, Vandana ma'am. Um, uh, I watched most most of the videos of in pathology from her. Uh, uh, also, uh, pathology uh, uh, pediatrics. Uh, I watched most most of the videos of Sandeep sir. It was uh, really helpful. Uh, then uh, in ophthalmology, uh, I watched. Watched most of the videos of uh, Shivani Madam. Uh, then in anatomy uh, and all uh, the general anatomy and uh, neurology part and all, I watched from SARS videos. Mm, then physiology as well. Uh, right. Okay. Right. And uh, see, when it comes to uh, understanding concepts, let's take with my subject like medicine. Uh, see, I'm sure that you have started attending my lectures from your final year MBBS itself, right? When you were preparing for the university exam. So uh, did the lectures give you a better understanding of the subject? Uh, obviously, sir. Um, this uh, first time I saw your classes was uh, uh, just before the uh, final year university exam. Uh, at that time, uh, we were all in a confused state. What will be the questions that will be asked? And uh, you were coming like a savior to uh, in front of us, like conducting uh, those uh, long sessions mainly at the uh, night time and all and we were eagerly waiting for that mm -hmm. and mm, we ha at that time i think we had some uh, tricky type of essays but uh, all of us could easily uh, get those uh, essays correct uh, for those people who have watched your videos at that time and prepared it from it and uh, uh, that uh, it, from that time onwards uh, uh most of us have been following your advices uh, in a, in your groups and all um then uh, after the uh, during the time of internship also uh, 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 when there were time uh, i tried to study a uh, few topics but i couldn't uh, had that grip throughout this uh, okay. but however i just gave the first attempt uh, since it didn't come well i uh, and try to invest this call year for this preparation right and uh, uh, you know when it comes like a subject like medicine as you said it requires a lot of understanding and uh, uh, see understanding is one aspect but again uh, revising is another aspect and uh, how did you find the revision videos like for medicine in the doc tutorial app the qrp 5.0 videos uh, uh, those those videos were uh, really concise. Like um, 
uh, i really like those uh, videos about uh, those topics like atrial fibrillation and all it's a, uh, a must not topic as uh, as this exam is concerned so uh, it it gives a chance to uh, just have a quick glance into the topic and uh, to know the must no points to know about the management uh, what are the buzzwords we should pick in the question uh this that really helped me uh, even a question was asked on the same topic in the uh, neat exam and right. um, it was easy for me to uh, pick up, pick that words and by uh, arrive at the answer so coming to um, other subjects like uh, pathology again an important subject for both inict and neat pg you said that you have watched uh, you know vandana ma'am's lectures fully so uh, how useful were madam's lectures Uh, sir, uh, for me, I, uh, I personally uh, like uh, very much in this topics like hematology and uh, techniques in uh, histopathology and pathology in general, like flow cytometry and all. Uh, Man's videos were very helpful. Like uh, uh, when I gave the first time, um, I need uh, there was questions from flow cytometry, and I had no clue about that. Uh, then, um, then uh, later I came to know that this is one of the important topics uh, which. Uh, they usually ask in, in all uh, uh, exams then i keenly watch these videos uh, uh, all those things like all those uh, videos about techniques and as well as those uh, wbc disorders uh, then uh, anemia topics those, those were uh, really helpful uh, um, seeing ma'am's videos i was also part of her uh, mentorship group in which she, uh, she used to uh, post the quizzes regularly and i used, used to attend those quizzes regularly also so i think you know that must have definitely given you an added advantage as well uh, yes. then coming to next subject ophthalmology uh, i'm sure you would have uh, listened to shivani ma'am's lectures so how useful were those lectures in making ophthalmology one of your stronger subjects uh, yes sir uh, initially uh, uh, even in the third year also ophthalmology was a bit difficult topic for me and uh, this uh, same thing i felt in the beginning of the preparation also Uh, I didn't have this conceptual understanding of the topic, which uh, I sh- I could gather through watching the ma- watching ma'am's videos. Like uh, most of the topics, uh, I could uh, ma'am used to uh, explain each and everything uh, in a slow pace, uh, and uh, things that are very important. She used to g- give emphasis on that. Mm. It was really good, and I, I used to uh, attend the quizzes she used to post in her Instagram handle and in the group also. so that is also very good to know and uh, then coming to next subject uh, pediatrics uh, again uh, i think sir actually makes a subject very interesting conceptual and also updated with the you know all the latest guidelines as well so your take on that uh, sir uh, for uh, i so past videos mainly uh, while preparing for the inset um, first time i wrote the inset and also in the next time also uh, i uh, went through sir's videos it was like uh, sir ha- ha- had this uh, way of teaching in which sir gave uh, pointed this other topics will be they usually ask in inis it and that gives a uh, good overview uh, like uh, we should be uh, uh, memorizing these kind of facts and all and uh, i personally uh, for me uh, the topics like uh, milestones uh, in um, pediatrics uh, sir has explained it in a very very nice manner and uh i used to uh, i think I, i have seen that videos like um, three or four times and i um, definitely um, that uh, after each time each time i see that i could uh, retain a much much uh, uh, amount of facts from that i think that is very important uh, areas that uh, that are volatile especially for pediatrics even uh, i yes, remember you know, learning all these milestones was confusing for me as well you know i've uh, written it down i have drawn pictures i have you know had this in my wall so i keep forgetting uh, all this uh, okay so I, <laughs> you know i've got uh, uh, another friend in you i have uh, you know same problem i also had so i think it's good that you found the lectures also useful now coming to uh, you know solving questions of the q bank coming to the grand test so how were the quality of uh, the mcqs whether it be from the q bank or grand test can you just elaborate on that uh, sir uh, the thing i used to do is when i see a video uh, like uh, after um, four to five days i just go back to the uh, notes again and i i used to give the uh, mcqs uh, most of the time uh, uh, other um uh, and as well as gts i i gave my gt first time after finishing two topics mm. okay 
that time mm, that time my marks were like mm, I, if i remember it's like 80 correct answers okay uh, but still i didn't care about that uh, rank and all i just yeah, I, i knew that i had finished a major part of the topic so i just uh, like that i uh, i followed like uh, a, a gt a month in the initial phases and all but uh, i could uh, complete most of the topics by january itself the first read uh, yeah. then from there mm, i gave a uh, more number of gts even the past gts i used to give at that time uh, yeah. then mm, once i give a, give a gt i'll uh, like um i'll spend like 3 to 4 hours to uh, review those uh, explanations and answers uh, that's how i used to to uh, make use of gts mm, and i could see that uh, like uh, my uh, number of correct answers got increased from uh, that uh, 80 and uh, somewhere in the uh, near uh, the examination uh, it was uh, like 130 correct answers and uh, when i gave when the exam got postponed i gave more number of gts then uh, it it come up like uh, 150 correct answers 160 and all i could reach up to that so which means that postponement you utilized it as an opportunity correct from a place where uh, yes, you were sir. getting 130 to this position right uh, that is very sure, important sir. because for many people this postponement affected their result. and i am sure you might have had friends as well who were preparing reasonably well but this postponement actually did more harm but in your case you utilize it as an opportunity am i right uh, yes sir uh, uh, like uh, for the earlier date when i planned the revision uh, uh, i reached at some phase, uh, phase that i i understood that i could not finish my revision at that time uh, and at, uh, and after that two, two two or three days after that i just came to know that the exam is postponed like for another two months uh, that was like such a good news for me actually Uh, i just uh, relaxed one day uh, then from the next day onwards i st- again started uh, going through my notes i gave um, more number of gts i think like uh, i gave um, eight eight gts on and all in that period right right so uh, is, and uh, then and i used to review that right right and again uh, what is your take on the rdx series uh, before inict and the 2020 series before neat pg the small 20 mcq test that were conducted in the doc tutorial sap followed by video discussion so how useful were they in your uh, exam preparation uh, hello sir yeah uh, uh, yeah uh, i attended uh, those uh, session those uh, exams like uh, i felt that those questions were like hand picked questions uh, especially for if it was for ins it that was uh, uh, of the pattern of those ins it questions and if it was for uh, neat it was that uh, type of questions asked in neat and i used to give uh, almost all uh, ex- uh, those exams i gave and i used to um, watch those uh, explanation um, videos that come just after that uh, 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 i uh, i think i got re- a reasonable number of corrects in those things and and i could say that like uh, before i ns it when i gave those uh, it really helped me like uh, there are many um, questions as such came in the exam also those uh, topics on which the questions were framed uh, when i when i reviewed those topics uh, it really helped me like um, to study that topics more and when questions came on that topics in the exam i could uh, easily come into the answers also so i think um, i am so happy that uh, especially the fact that you uh, came back from a rank of 84000 to this amazing rank through sheer determination and hard work so ashwin a lot of congratulations uh, and uh, all the best for your future as well thank you so much for joining thank you sir